Hello and welcome back. Today I am going to show you a technique to create this interactive animated quiz that will help you to engage your audience in your presentation. And of course, we are going to use our own Microsoft PowerPoint. So let's start the video. Let's insert a new blank slide. For that, go to Home, Slides Group, New Slide and select blank slide. Now go to insert tab and select text box. Draw a text box and write the slide title. Change font size and font style according to your wish. Since we are going to work with multiple objects, therefore it's better to enable the select panel. For that go to home tab, editing group, select and click on selection pane. Now we are going to create the first box for questions. For that go to insert shapes and select a box. From the selection pane rename the rectangle 2 to question 1. Also edit the rectangle text. For that right click and edit text. Question 1. Now press ctrl C to copy and ctrl V to paste. Arrange the box on the top of the first box. Rename the box name to answer 1. And change the color of the box. For that go to shape format and select any color from the shape fill. Since this box will show the answer therefore replace quotient with answer. From this selection pane drag answer 1 below quotient 1 like this. Now select the quotient 1 box, go to animation tab, from the animation group, click on this arrow to have more animation and select more exit effect. From this dialog box select swivel, press ok. From the animation tab, timing group, decrease timing to 50 seconds. Now from selection pen, hide quotient 1 and apply Entrance Sewell effect from the animation tab. Go to animation tab, animation group, click on this arrow and from the entrance effect select Sewell. Decrease the timing to 50 seconds and start after previous. Unhide the quotient 1. Let's check out the animation effect in the slideshow. For that go to slideshow and select from current slide. Click on quotient 1. And here we got the answer one option. We will copy both of these boxes. Control C, Control V, arrange, update the name quotient one to quotient two, answer one to answer two, change your quotient, hide your quotient box, change your answer, unhide your quotient box. Again, select your both boxes and keep this job until you get your questions on this slide. If you like this tutorial, click on thumbs up button below. You can also suggest topic for future video in the comments. See you in the next tutorial.